Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Sunday. Welcome to something unusual. This is a game that I've been kind of sitting on for a while. I, and I realized I didn't plan anything for October like I usually do. Hello, AOC. Um, so normally I have something horror-themed in mind uh, come October for Halloween and all that. This year, it kind of blew past me. I didn't even think about it. I had a lot of other things going on. So I had nothing prepared. But I've been kind of sitting on this game for a while. It looked interesting. I've heard a lot of good things about it. I don't know if it's really a horror game. I just think it's going to be kind of creepy, kind of weird, and kind of interesting. So I thought we'd give it a shot. Now, as I said, this doesn't strike me as a horror game. But usually when I do horror games... I have a webcam on, which is probably a shock to some of you newcomers. So, it is what it is. I don't know if reactions, live reactions, are going to be meaningful in any way, but let's give it a shot. Let me get the volume back on. So, all I know about this game, which is basically that it's really loud. Let's turn that down. Um, all I know about this game is it's very, uh, one of those like weird kind of what do you call them, like meta-fictional kind of games. And it has a lot of things that kind of go on in the background. Yeah, I, I played it for like an hour or so, I think a year ago, just to see what it was all about. And it was doing like pop-ups and had like text files that were coming up on the on the screen and all sorts of weird shit in the background. So I don't know if, it, none of that's probably gonna come through, but it is a, uh, it is gonna be a strange game, I think. Shall we get started? Oh, that's so sweet. Not a whole lot of controls, I don't think. All right, I'll figure out this out as we go. Picked up an item you selected from your inventory. Good to know. It was a pretty good AOC. Um, started a lot later than I meant to, and but we got through a lot of stuff. We're finally moved on to Skellige. So, that'll be interesting. Best experience in windowed mode, which it is, even though I want it in full screen, but I'll take its word for it. And some big ol' eyes. So it's one of these, like, RPG Maker kind of games that were, like, all the rage back in the day. Hey, hello. Small child living in such a squalor. This is horrible. Ah, uh, no problem, BOC. Okay, I've already forgotten the controls. Inventory is Y. Dusty books. Correct. That's the face of the remote. Seven is green, one is blue, six is yellow, two is red. I'm not going to remember that. Seven. I done goofed. Oh, uh, well, God, I mixed up the order. Okay, so... Gets... Me one... Seven, two, six. Damn it all. Six. Sweet. Whoa, there's a... There's a bent screen. I found you. Why? I don't know. Well, that's a horrible thing to say.
I'm actually kind of glad that it didn't show this pop-up because it's got my real name on it. And that's disturbing. It told me I only have one shot. So that's one of the things this game does. It actually, it, like, pulls your name from your account. So if I... If I, like, if my Windows account was, like, Baller420, then that would be my name in the game. So I, I think the weird thing about this game is, like, you're not the main character. You're somebody controlling the main character. So, like, you, the player, are a character in the game. In a weird way. Oh, that's dangerous. Uh, maybe we should unplug that. Well, I don't have the remote anymore, so we can't watch TV. Alcohol. How old are you, kid? You can't have that. Can I take the wood? Okay, well, I can't splash booze on it and then light it with a spark from the TV, I guess. Okay, well, there's definitely a door there. Just a chair. There's holes in the floor. Guess I can't drop to the basement. All I have this is this. Is there something else in here? Just woke up there. Well, go back to bed. Clearly having a nightmare. Oh! Withered plant. Damn. Just broke it. So we got a branch. Perhaps. Okay. We got a drunk stick now. I'm gonna say we use a spark to light this. Roosh. I'm sure alcohol burns hot enough to light something like that. Ooh, okay. Oh boy, spooky stairs. Alright, sweet. Turn the lights on. Actually, no, there's probably no power in here. No, there must be, because the TV was on. Oh! That's bright. Alright. Apparently, I induce my own current on the light bulb. So, like I said, I did fire this up a long time ago, but I never got far. I just kind of sat on it for a year or two. I don't know what we're up to. That looks light bulb shaped. Where the hell am I now? I thought that opened the door, but apparently it teleported me. Whoa. We're on the moon. No location you visit by fast travel is A? What does that mean in gamepad terms? Start. Oh, I got you. Good to know. Oh, dead robots. This is a strange place. Like a Stargate. Remember the like maps were surprisingly big and kind of 
strange to navigate. Hello, never. Long time no see. Whoa. Uh-oh. Is that a friendly robot? I'm here. Mindustry is free? What is that? Yes. Where exactly is this world? Our defense factorio. Sounds interesting. If it's free, I'll grab it. I don't know if I'll ever play it. Is that part of the prophecy? Oh, I knew it. There's always a prophecy. Leave the world from eternal darkness. Well, I got a light bulb. Sun. Okay, I guess the light bulb is their sun. This light bulb was in a house the whole time. Although well, it seems like that house was a, uh, a figment of our imagination somehow. Well, I have, I have the light bulb. Can I just give it to you? Why don't you put it up there? Oh boy. Maybe we shouldn't have made it out of glass. Oh god, it said my name. Alright, well, you all know my first name now. Sweet, I'm God. <laughs> Not the God sim I was uh, waiting for, exactly. the fourth wall here. Oh, I can change my name? Nah, that's my name. Hello, child. Hey, Black Wolf. It's not a face reveal. Alright, I've, I've, I've revealed it before. Alright, well, that was a... That was a heartwarming introduction. The small child is apparently Jesus. Nice. Ah, you people just kidnap your saviors. Alright, well, we have no choice but to redeem the sun, I guess. Because this small child can't leave without it. Use of a robot as our replacement head engineer seems unorthodox. Especially 
the the one responsible for last year's incident. Uh oh, incident. Yeah, my deep dark secret. I am actually God of a small, strange 16-bit world. Various form of blue phosphor is found during the phosphor shrimp spawn period. Ooh, phosphor shrimp. And some bright ass shrimp. Ooh, that's spooky. So this seems to suggest that there are, were, or are actual humans in this world, not just robots. Bookshelves. I feel like this is one of those games you gotta click on everything. Well, the hat's on because my hair's a bit of a mess. So I don't, I don't want to look like some scruffy weirdo. Place your self-charging battery in full daylight with a lens facing up. Charges in seconds, no external power needed. Battery fails to charge, check to see if the lens on the front side has not been dislodged during transport. One charge cycle will last about 10 days. Decline in the charge cycle within the warranty period, contact the manufacturer. Well, I don't have a battery. Robot may not injure a living person or through an action allow a person to come to harm. Robot must obey the orders given by people except where such orders would conflict with the first law. Must protect its own existence as long as such protection does not conflict with the first or second law. Interesting. Okay, so we're on the outskirts. By all appearances, the interior locations are a lot nicer more scenic. I'll bet you one of these shells in this entire game will have something that I need. If I power to all machinery in the area via electromagnetic field, maintenance efforts are quite high. Backup cells, electromagnetic field, uh, I can't speak. Well damn, is this my battery? I'll take the shrimps. Alright, well, can't do anything with it. Hmm. Put the, put the jar of shrimp in there. Nice shirt, thanks. It's a, it's a flannel. It's a little chilly today. Oh, the robot actually moves. I'm scooting about. Sorry, I skipped through these fast than I meant to. Mournful gaze when it says that. I think it's got some kind of autonomy. Well, damn. That's heartbreaking. What a very specific prophecy. If it wasn't for the fact that I did exactly that and it's very unusual, I would say this prophecy is bullshit. This is a studio lamp. Sorry, I should have I should have cleared the scene. It struck the set a little bit. That one's not even plugged in, so don't do anything. I've dimmed the lights a little bit because this is supposed to be spooky, spooked over. But the 
can't have the lights off, otherwise this webcam is meaningless. Alright. Well, I hear machines. There are a lot of dead robots around here. I find it suspicious that one remains. Maybe all this was his doing. Oh, jeez. That don't look healthy. Put the light bulb in there. <laughs> All right, we stay away. This one ain't moving. So yeah, one thing that kind of bugs me about games like this, and this is probably just a personal thing because I'm dumb, but... When we run into so many areas that are clearly important, I have to, like, progress and find items and bring them back. I usually have trouble remembering what I've seen before and how new discoveries apply to that. So, let's try and remember. If anything needs to be crushed, I know where there's a crusher. We find a battery, I know where to charge it, I think. Poisonous gas. Hmm. No oh boy, we're getting we're getting some tight turns here. See, I hate this. I hate these cardinal direction like controls when you have a diagonal pathway like that. There's an object over there. Someone will not return, and the abyss is calling my name. Sorry, everyone, for choosing to leave before the darkness suffocates us all. Well, that's bleak. I guess some kind of apocalypse befell this place. I don't know, I'm a, I'm a little concerned that there don't seem to be any people left and like, there's nothing left for us to really save at this point. I forgot the child talks to me. I don't know any codes. Robots, discovery of Alloy 291 will allow the development of high efficient circuitry. How interesting. Well, I guess we keep moving northeast ish. The soundtrack is very repetitive, but I do enjoy it. That, that one that remains get its power from. Really don't trust him. Whoa, hello. There's a human. Yes, the light bulb. Oh, they always expect someone taller. Yeah, I'm a cat with a human face that walks on two legs. Well, not all of us get to choose our birthright. Damn, girl. That's cold. It's 
actually kind of reminds me of, um, I think Dark Souls 3 had a subplot where it was basically the idea of a savior that was kind of born too late to actually do anything. It's kind of a cruel irony. just be too convenient. Towers don't just appear. Even Zardas had to summon demons to do it. Alright, well, I had more questions, but I guess not. News about the mind. Can't imagine what you're feeling. It's been two weeks. It must be hard. It's better that you came back. It's only a matter of time before the robots are recalled. Interesting. Oh. I don't think she is human then. Just a human like android. How, if, if all of your energy is based on the sun, how do you even recharge your batteries? Sweet. Now, is it Phillips or a flathead? That kind of, kind of affects things. Now, don't, don't spill the shrimps. by tamed. Is that like made human? I guess we're not taking a nap. Well, off we go. Where? Oh, I think there's a... Before we forget where I'm going. I think there was a box I need to pry open, so the screwdriver will probably work on that. If I can even remember how to get back there. Can I go this way? Uh, yeah, I remember reading that. Well, damn, that was a waste of time. Yes, we'll keep moving in the direction we were going. Are you kidding? Oh, geez, I dropped my controller. Trying to multitask here. We need to remember if we ever find a six digit code. Is 
resist the mines. Hey. Oh, okay, sweet. Well, we have protection, I guess. Grabbed it. Oh, okay. I didn't mean to do that, but well, we have a lens now. Jeez, isn't it wonderful when I complete puzzles by accident? Well, surely we need a jar of shrimp at some point. Why can't I take those? Nobody else is using them. Jeez, you didn't even seem remotely concerned about any of this a minute ago. <clears throat> well, hang on, didn't you just say this was your alternate fuel? Why would you abandon that if the sun? was kind of what you depended on. Oh, well, maybe we should go find out. All right, well, I have a camera lens. Why well, does she, like, harass me if I keep going back? Oh, no, she doesn't. Keep going. Oh, no, guess not. A <laughs> safety violation. Oh, jeez. You're on your own, kid. Break the rules a little. Alright. Well, can't ask any more questions. Don't think we need a camera lens anywhere, so I guess I'll just try going in another direction. Where do we start? Entrance? I mean, at least there's fast travel. I didn't realize you could fast travel to each screen. I had assumed that there were fast travel locations. to do about it. Alright. Well, good thought, kid, but how the hell are we going to do that? Got another trailer here. Ooh. Alright, sweet. We got the means to murder Colonel Custard. In the study. Well, jeez, all right. I'm trying to save the world here, but go for it. What the hell just happened? Holy shit, the game closed. What? Well, okay. Was that supposed to happen? Oh. This is different. It didn't start with a splash screen last time. That was, that was weird. Uh, yes? Why is spooky music happening? No way, child.
Hmm. This is getting real meta. Uh, no. Great balls of fire. I think we live on the same planet, child. <laughs> yeah, this is this is like beyond the fourth wall at this point. I don't want this child to get too homesick. We've got a stupid world to save. So that must have been intentional that the game closed when he went to sleep. So that they could do that when it relaunched. Alright. Guess we need to find a gas mask. Now I don't know what to do. I don't know when the hell we needed a camera lens at any point. We can't interact with the sparkle pools. We got a light bulb, empty bottle, metal rod, camera lens. Oh, we can, okay, we can use the rod to open that box. I get you now. I have the means. Oh, okay. Well, that's obvious. We go give it a smash. Well, maybe we should get a machine to do this, but... Uh, be careful. Well, you did it, kid. broken? Well, that's no help to us. Well, combine these. Oh, how convenient. Camera lens was the perfect fit for whatever the hell the glass on this battery was. Um, so do we charge it here, perhaps? Profit bot. Alright, well, open your eyes, kid. This is important information. So I guess that's uh, how that robot charges itself. Okay, so we gotta charge the battery. Where do we charge it? it in some sparkly shrimp. Old daylight with the lens facing up. Oh, I get ya. Jeez, it was just a little more obvious. Alright. So now we stick this in the machine. That's progress. Okay, what's that done? Whoa. 
All right, don't touch that. Jesus. Safety standards here are... Whoa, hello. Robots are alive. Well, geez. All right, maybe we're saving the world after all. Sure. All right, so we have new robo-friends to speak at. Oh, no, all these ones out here are still dead. Are there any other ones in the world alive? No, they're all busted. I guess there's only the ones in that building. I'm not sure what we really accomplished then. been through all this. <clears throat> oh, what, what do y'all fools do? Oh, the computer's on. I have. Hey. Uh-oh. Uh... Start looking! Oh boy, I know what's going on. Stand by, folks. It's buried in the game file somewhere. I know how this works. I've never actually played a game like this before. The fourth wall breaking and the... All that weird stuff. Where would it be? Read me? Credits? sure. Maybe documents? I'm like so hyper paranoid that you people can see what I, my Windows Explorer, but I know you can't. Where'd it be? I know you can't, but it still weirds me out. Like, even, even, oh my god, my webcam is way saturated. Stand by. That didn't work. I don't know how to deal with webcams. That's why I don't actually use them. All right, well, that's still a little weird. I'm whom? Hello, Vale. I'm... Where... Where... Where would this code be? Unless the meta joke is that I'm supposed to Google it. I don't think that's the wrong answer. But then, how would people have solved it when they were the first ones playing this game? What the hell is this? Oh, I think I just opened up a spoiler by accident. Shot's not here. Don't lie to me. Oh, really? I'm pretty sure I've worn this bef on stream before. I actually specifically bought a, like, logo-less hat because 
I don't want people to think I had some kind of weird brand brand loyalty or sponsorship or something. Huh. I don't know where this uh where this document is. I just ran something with a clover on it. Hmm. I don't think that was the right solution. Maybe I'm barking up the wrong tree. They said the it no longer exists. The code no longer exists in this world. It's gotta exist in the files somewhere. I thought that was a whole idea. That's what I thought. I actually just googled it. Documents. What the hell would it be in here? No, those bots run on machines. On the, well, I put a battery in downstairs, but apparently we can charge it in half a second, so they do take a nap. I'll be back. I don't know where to find this code. I'm in the folder that Google told me. Oh, hang on, they lied to me. This way, I suppose. The same damn folder. Be modified. Oh, there it is. Jesus. Dear Smudge message to you and I'm afraid I must make it brief I have left your journal part of which is written in a language that smudge read it and you'll know what to do code you need is 942643 alright well he's excited alright he gets to move again he's got legs writing this down for memory don't let me forget it what the hell just happened why music I didn't tell you to do that Alright, back in action. Uh, where do we need this again? I think there's a safe in this direction. What the hell is Keemstar Bell? I'm actually curious. Is that like another streamer? Who's like some kind of weirdo? Yeah, go ahead. Give that number a call. See who you get. Villain of YouTube. Elaborate. Is he just like one of those douchebag like pranksters or... Was he an all-around piece of shit? Oh, I remember. Nine. Four. Two. Six. Four. Three. I have my secrets. Oh, that guy. 
Okay, I vaguely remember that guy. Uh, I want to be frank with this kid. We're going to be working together. No reason to keep secrets. Hey! Well, show it to me. It's got a clover on it. What? Just, uh, I don't know. It's spook. You gonna chase me? Can I, can I reach it somehow? What do I do with that? Hmm. That's spooky. There's an application in the game's folder that has that clover icon on it. I wonder if that means I'm supposed to look for it. Didn't do that now. Should I have that running, like, as we move? Hmm, I don't know. I don't know if there's a, a way you can really fuck this game up. I think there are multiple endings. I know the whole idea is it's kind of like a no restarts kind of thing. Because actually, just to clear my... Just to clear my save file from before, I had to basically uninstall the game, disable cloud saves, and delete the folder. Thanks, Orbaron. Also welcome. Now, I'll have the gas mask. I guess we can go where the gas were. Can you tell me about this book? I guess not. No, no, no. Maybe that woman can read the book for me, but whatever. We'll go back to that later. For now, we try and make progress. Oh, hello. You're awake. Alright, so they are all destroyed. Ooh, maybe the boatman's alive again. Oh, he's gone. Oh, no, there he is. Hey, he's alive. Poor I. Robot. <laughs> um. All right, well, we need some grease. Well, good. We can keep moving. Oh, jeez. Well, he looks real creepy now. Well, filters on gas masks don't last forever. That's what Metro 2033 told me. And actually, any other game that had a gas mask, for that matter. Ooh, bubble. Wait. Oh, I lost the eyes. Uh, I lost a screwdriver. I will smack the bubble with a stick. Bubbles are made for popping.
Okay. What are this? Our team off guard, they reacted as quickly as they did. First expedition brought up some interesting observations about the barons. Not one, but two such vent zones. A miracle that the gas hadn't spread anywhere else. Biologists conclude that phosphor shrimp in the crater pools were actively consuming the gas. Alright, well, Jesus. Better make sure you bump up your conservation efforts with these shrimps. Apparently, your life depends on it. Oh boy, new building. And speak of the robot. <clears throat> well, that's awfully kind. Get in the door. Evacuation. Can't believe this. First, the sun dies. Now I'm out of a job. All right. Well, one of those seems like a bigger problem than the other. I will take it. I need blueprints later. Yes, it's a letter. I can see. I will suck it up, kid. Oh, well, Jesus, I guess the world's doomed. Alright, I will be right back. Stand by. People lived in these? People actually lived in these, Jesus. Like those freaking uh, capsule apartments in Deus Ex. By the author. The author. We don't need anything up there, otherwise this kid's gotta gotta man up. Organic person who was alive. Oh sweet, we got a hospital. Sweet. I feel invaded though. 
Ew. Alright, well, don't go sticking yourself with strange needles. Even if it did come from a hospital. What the hell is this guy playing with? Okay, that's all we need here, I guess. This is a very lively part of town. Alright, I guess. Do a robot voice. Ah, oh boy. I think we've offended. Get over it, kid. You've made a friend. A serious one, you should play Gothic one again. I That's a tall order though. I mean that was supposed to be my 100% walkthrough, and I know I did kind of a sloppy job of it, but until I'm as upset about that series as I am currently about my old Gothic 2 series, I don't see myself doing it again. Alright, well, he's not that interesting. At least he gave us some insight into robot anatomy. Operation can all no longer be sustained if the servers continue to fail so much that maintenance cannot keep up the pace. Does not seem to be happening to the robots. Oh, they're all a little bit busted, buddy. these freaking apartments water stretch around the forest water surrounding the forest stretch until the boundaries of space prehistoric oceans receded forming what is now the barrens I feel like I should have been checking all of these for a sign of something Side. Guardian of the residential area. Interesting. Uh oh. He's dying. Evacuating the few tamed robots we have. No point in keeping them in the barrens if all the people are already gone. Phase one of the evacuation ended prematurely. Big ships started malfunctioning after only a few round trips. Something with squares? Oh boy. These people get left behind, perhaps. Whoa, that's a big man. Messiah. Like how his name is actual, actually Prophet Bot. Oh, it's a Guardian Bot. Oh, 
Nobody really explains what tamed means. Alright, good to know. I have backup. fields accumulate rust slower than the others. Ah, oh, so do we need to capture gas for... to help fishermen? Robot? Oh, okay. Oh, hang on. Sounds like we're back at the start. Oh, we are. I don't know what I was meant to do about that weird pixel effect over here. I'm trying to talk at you. Alrighty. Now, where are your gloves? Oh, okay, so it's one of those you always wear. Leading solvents in this environment, here's a simple recipe using the alternative method discussed in the chapter using the natural properties of blue phosphor. Acidic gas, blue phosphor. Well ventilated area, direct the gas into your container of choice, seal immediately. Alright, that's helpful. Alright. Sweet. What a handy tool this is. Without breaking the seal, inject the liquid into the liquid phosphor into the container. Shake vigorously to initiate the reaction, use as soon as possible. The element begins to separate for the shaking is required. Hand protection is critical, resulting acid is moderately stronger than common household cleaners. Alright, well, we, we're mixing chemicals. It's exactly what a small child should be doing. Ooh, I got a spoon. know what I do with a sponge. Maybe we have to give the, give the robot a scrub. So what? I gotta capture some gas and inject it with blue phosphor? Okay, remember there was, there was one at, like, hand height. Then we gotta go find that one again. Oh, what's this? Oh, we already read that. Where do I use a syringe? That I don't know.
Sweet. Bottled some gas. Now I need a syringe of blue phosphorus. But I don't know how to get that. I thought the I thought the shrimps were phosphorus. I can't grab them. I keep forgetting I can do this. A secret. Mm. Oh, I mentioned this woman has some with like a mesh top. Maybe I stick it in there. Inject the liquid phosphor into the container, shake vigorously. Where do I find that then? of thing. to do that. Just missed something somewhere. Oh, hang on, these ones are alive. Well, good for y'all. running in circles now. about this one. I noticed this one earlier. It doesn't twinkle as fast. I guess that doesn't mean anything. Okay. 
Thought maybe that was enough, but it ain't. Must be something else here. Oh, we got bubblage. Well, that wasn't what I intended. All right, secret is revealed at least. Do it again. Now we need these. Time for some chemistry. Damn right it did. Alright, so now... This upon this. That's right. Ball of acid. aware that whatever this acid is hopefully it's a uh, suitable cleaner and lubricant for this robot well I got the sponge damn right kid <laughs> Sweet. Oh, for Christ's sake. Head engineer? Is that that woman? You, the engineer. Oh, what's with this clover symbolism? I wonder. Elaborate. Oh, she's got autonomy. Right. Ah. Oh, geez, we're going to play chess. I'm terrible at chess. Oh, this is adorable. Got left behind? That's awful.
a little fatalistic, but perhaps more realistic than the absurd uh, prophecies of ProfitBot. Right. Docs. Kid need to sleep again? Nope. I have this thing with a jig. Apparently this is what you need. No, no. Well, we might need those. Alright, I guess we're in chapter 2 now, and that means starting from nothing. Whoa. That's a lot of fireflies. Well, then who's going to get me back there if I need to? That seems like a much nicer place. Whoa. Interesting. Man, just you have like two parts of the same house that are separated by a balcony. That seems silly. Well, all right then. Oh, hello. You're a little frightening. Is that a human? I don't know what the hell that is. It looks like a bird. That's unfortunate. Why does everyone just have like water in their house? Whoa. At least there's habitation here. I mean, I think the water is pretty obvious without that, but then again, I have the sun in my hand, so. Well, don't let anyone else touch it. This is important. These people all have shiny shrimps, too. I don't know, they have fireflies. Whoa, that's a lot of pots. I mean, it's encroached quite heavily on your homes here. I would recommend making that decision sooner rather than later. It's, uh, encouraging. Oh, we got sheeps. One of them named Betsy. I'm working on it. Whoa, you look important.
Really? Oh, well, I can't put the sun down until... What is that sheep doing? He's going nuts. I can't put the sun down until, like, I am at the tower, so... Your sheeps are going to be running around like nutcases until then. Gypsy cart. Trade. I don't think so. Ooh. I'm not giving these up. Oh, seem important. Alright. Find a machete. Yeah, I'll give you the sheep. What if I, what would happen if I tried to trade the sun duel? <laughs> Alright, so can't give him much of anything. I'm not giving him the amber. I'm sure the engineer will want that back. Okay, makes sense. Whoa. Put the sun on the altar? Maybe that's close enough. Nope. again? Pretty sure she would never speak to me again. <laughs> Alright. What else am I looking for here? Oh, come on. Spare me. Southeast. How do, you, how do you have those bearings when there's no sun? A. Eh? Who's asking? Start looking for a small child. There's somebody fishing there. Such, it's such a narrow little stream. How are you catching big fish there? Are these the ruins? Oh, there's a big bot.
Are you kidding me? You can't just let me in. I'm I'm the savior. You're making me look for a damn pen so I can check in. Alrighty. Damn, that's some serious vineage. I get the feeling that weird trader dude sells something I need for the vines, but I've got naught to give him. Uh oh. Oh, jeez. Something flashed. What has happened? It has fallen to the most easily accessible place on my machine. Uh, no? What? On my desktop? What? Oh my god, it changed my background. Are you mad? Can't touch that. Holy shit, that's weird. They actually it changed my desktop background to, I guess, a solution to this puzzle. Stand by. Completely screwed me up. Yeah, it's fucking, uh... Gonna charge me a ransom soon. Alright, well, I have it. I can see it. Ah, uh, it looks like a light bulb. I absolutely don't know what to do with that. Another document. It's even more obvious. Listen, I see it, okay? But it doesn't tell me anything. It's literally just like an image of a light bulb, I assume. But it's like... It's like a six by five square thing. I don't, I don't know what to do with this information. You know, maybe we're playing uh, Connect the Dots or something later on. Two children. That's dangerous. What are they doing living down here? They're going to drown. Hopefully it changes my desktop back when, when it's done, because I don't even remember what it was. Oh? Ooh. This looks spookage. Whoa! Tree child. Now it's dark. I hope that was the right thing to do. She cleared the vines somewhere, I guess. Up above. Oh boy. 
You might get in a lot of trouble for uh, giving up the sun to some strange person. Where else were there vines? There was more in here. Here we are. Oh, here it is. Man, how am I supposed to do this? How do I get the middle one, though? It's gonna be one of them weird ass puzzles. Oh, because it does weird things. Ah, nailed it. I guess that was easier than I thought. Hello, bird child. Whoa! Okay, my desktop is back. Alright, good. That was weird. Alula. in there. Oh, nothing. Alright, let's go, small child. It's that simple. Hey, you're hugging me a little closer, child. Maybe we should go get the sun back before we leave. Say anything? Well, oh. do you two know each other? I'm a little worried leaving that here. There you go. Oh, I've seen those. Apparently, this is my choice. Alright. Well, guess we're having dinner. <laughs> well, just showed us up. I 
Come on, we have to go back through the ruins to get there? Isn't this where danger happened? Oh, it's in the ruins. That's weird. What have you found? Whoa, it's a feather. to a quill and sign that stupid scroll. Dude, she's like seven years old, all right? That's a little weird. Also, I don't think that's a real rule. Written or otherwise. Don't, don't, don't. Alright, well, so far nobody seems concerned with the fact that we left the sun behind. Well, geez, clean up the place a little bit if you're going to have company. I they have three beds, but only two occupants. Uh, yeah, I would say so. That's why I'm supposed to have a refrigerator. Also, I like the video gaminess that, <laughs> like, uh, an obstacle in your path can just be kicked out of the way by somebody in the game. But you obviously couldn't do it yourself. Okay. Jeez. Well, I just don't wanna leave I don't wanna leave that behind. If uh something bad happens. Let's see what's more in this direction. Get moving. Oh, okay. We got company. Oh, ho. Almost seems suspicious, like they're trying to watch me. And yeah, we'll f put some air in it. Fish. I need a boat. You all look like birds, though. Why can't you fly? Find somebody who can fly or something to get us to the sacred grounds. I guess. Oh, nothing we can do here.
Oh, we're back here. Okay. Uh. Oh, I don't want to give up any of these, though. These all are, like, super nice things. So we'll keep looking around. Hopefully we can find some something trade worthy that doesn't have such sentimental value. Wasn't there another place with vines? Oh, hang on, I don't have the sun anymore, so I guess I can hard cheat for this guy. Peninsula. Bring a bell. I, don't, I ain't got a bell. Move them onto darker... Oh, this is one of them weird-ass puzzles. I think I fucked that up. Um. I'm gonna say he probably goes there. Sokoban? I don't even know what that is. It's just memes. So you need to go there. Well, that was pretty easy. <laughs> that was cute. Fine ramble. Put boxes on specific spots. Oh, okay. Yeah, I guess that's what it was. Also, hello, Vosser. Welcome. All right, so I got I got awesome wool. Kind of useless. Good. Let's sell it. is. This guy's got a creepish smile. Will dark blue liquid for dying wool. Well, shoot. We don't have wool anymore because we gave it up for that. Let's see what's going on. Uh, I'm just playing a weird little game. Not much going on. Pretty chill. It is aught AM. It is... Five o'clock here. I should probably get going soon so I can mow the lawn before it gets dark. Otherwise, I'm not going to get to it all week. <laughs> 1,333 1, megahertz. Well, that's adorable. Um, BRB.
technically, Val, I think this game kind of sort of came out before Undertale, at least in uh, beta form, from what I have read. I think that's kind of my curse AOC. I think people show up, see when I'm not streaming, and then they're just like, what the hell is this, and leave. Stop Jesus. Neko Cat C 2003. Thank you for following. Let's call you Neko. Hello, how are you? Where am I to go now? I got what do we get? We got a bottle of dye, apparently for wool, which I just traded for the dye, so. Do I like vicious circle? Never heard of it. I suppose I shall look into it. Now, perhaps now I go get the sun back? Hello, Dryan. Shoot a collector, you collect nuggets, and avoid giant alien chicken in the process. Hmm. That sounds interesting. Could be worth looking into. I don't do a whole lot of puzzle games, but... Lately, I've been kind of craving them. It's a change of pace. Oh god, the sun's out. Oh shit. I knew that was a bad idea. Oh, hang on. Oh, it's back. A kernel of corn? <laughs> of all things. Oh, that's why her name is Maze. I get it. I get it. Alright, well, I kind of forgot that the child picking up... Nico picking up the light bulb seems to be what illuminates it. Which begs the question, when we place it there, do we have to sit there all day and hold on to it just to make sure it never goes out? Uh, never heard of that either, Neko. I shall catalog that for later. door here. Uh, apparently not. Is it go? Is it motorcycle? That would be pretty bitchin'. So in the kids next door, I saw an Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Which is a vastly superior cartoon. Alright, well, I still don't have a pen. I use this, like, feather as a quill, perhaps? Guess not. Oh, if I do this, though. Well, now it just ruined the feather, which is apparently a very sacred item, but whatever, let's give it a shot. Oh boy. That ink's gonna dry up. There's a bed to the west, I guess? I don't know 
know what the hell you saw, child. Dr. Silverpoint. I don't know who that is. What is knocking? My phone's a knocking. And the house is a rocking. Mama Adley, how are you? Stream's going all right. Hello, person. You two just said the same thing. Who's this Dr. Silverpoint? Whoa, purple robot. Alright, bring me with you. Tells me we're gonna need to fill that battery later. Help with anything? Uh, I don't think so. I think we're good for now. I won't touch the trees. Touch. Sweet, free water. Stop Jesus! I need to quiet that thing down. It always scares the shit out of me. Thank you for following, Mama Adley. Uh, water and seed? Nope. Uh-oh, squares. I'm enjoying it so far. I don't know how long it is because we're already at the second area. Uh, I'm gonna gauge how dark it is before I call the stream and do some yard work. Right, well, we need to find Nico a bed, and that's she's probably gonna kick me out of the game again. That's where I'll call it for the eve. Why this dude left his lantern out here? Why are there so many stumps? Four hours of all the interesting things. I mean, I, I haven't been, like, rushing it. I'm sure it'll take me a fair few hours, but... I don't know. Oh yeah, there. Can you not sleep in that bed? You asked for a bed, child. I don't know where else. He said to the west, but I don't, I don't see any uh, homes in this direction. Get a reminder of where we wanted to go. Whoa, hang on. Near the gate? What gate? Like where we started? Where the f uh, the rowboat robot brought us?
Oh, the gate. Hey, what? Oh, okay. This, okay, this door was bevined before. All right, take a nap. And the game closed. All right, well, this is, seems like an interesting game. I think we'll pick it up again next week, but as I said, it's getting dark and I have to mow the lawn, so that's where we'll leave it tonight. Uh, pick it up next Sunday, same time, same place. Might even finish it then, depending on how much is left. Um, otherwise, Saturday, back with The Witcher 3 again. And uh, expect another Gothic 2 video by the end of the week on YouTube, if you uh, are looking forward to that. Otherwise, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for hanging out, and have a wonderful night.